Hey everybody, it's Isaiah from Cone Fi. Uh, just doing some cooking at home actually in the kitchen. This video is for Nicole. She's uh, never worked with tofu before and she asked if there were any simple preparations so I thought I'd add this to the mix. This is something you can make um, at home by yourself or you can even uh, church it up a little bit, serve it for a dinner party, something like that, really cool. Tofu is super versatile, talked about it before. Um, you can leave it in soup and it is a great texture but we're gonna grill it today so I've got my pan going with some uh, extra virgin olive oil I've done it with just like Pam cooking spray and it sticks pretty well even with this non-stick pan the other thing is we have it nice and uh, seasoned so cracked black pepper uh, some coarse sea salt on there and we're just gonna put these on the grill and put some grill lines on there now these aren't going to give you grill lines like a traditional uh, meat they're gonna be a little bit lighter uh, especially cooking on a grill pan, not cooking outdoors, but um, it still works just the same. We slice them in half, as you can see, so they're not too thick, and it doesn't take these very long to cook. Um, probably just two minutes on each side, and then we'll turn it over, and I'll show you the presentation. Okay. So all I did was turn these over and cook them for about two more minutes on the other side. We have some slight grill marks down there that you can see. Uh, I'm cooking it on a medium high heat. Uh, and we also did not uh, squeeze them. We obviously drained the extra water that was uh, inside the packaging, but I didn't press these or do anything like that. So um, they come off the pan quite nicely, not too bad there. And I'll show you how we plate these. And uh, how you guys can do this at home too. It's really simple. Turn that flame off there. So um, what I have is just a couple other ingredients. So we have our seasoned tofu, and I love the taste of tofu by itself, so the seasoning just adds a little bit more flavor. Like everyone says, it's going to absorb a lot of the taste that you put on there, so uh, feel free to add any more ingredients that you'd like to this um, as far as after the presentation's done. We're just using uh, like a sweet and sour sauce. You can get a plum sauce from a local restaurant or find one at, um, you know, the uh, international market aisle, I'm sure. Um, this is one we make at the restaurant, same idea, and we're just going to kind of coat the tofu with the sauce and we're going to give it some really nice flavor here. Same things that we did with our spring rolls in. We're also going to take some crushed peanuts and we're going to go over the top of them, be a little bit generous there. Like I said, if you want to, you can kind of go around the entire plate to give it a little more. There you go. And then some fresh cilantro, just bunched up in the middle. And that's it. And that's how we prepare ours. Uh, we fry it at the restaurant, but this is also uh, the same take, uh, just with grilled, and it tastes just as good. So uh, if you have any questions, let me know. Enjoy.